So to no one's surprise, Magirna has been banned from the Gen 9 overview steer effective immediately. Uh, this was announced about an hour ago. And um, yeah, if you didn't know, the OU Council was voting on Pokemon that potentially might get banned. Uh, there were a couple Pokemon. It's uh, on yeah, these were the Pokemon that were discussed, including also including the item Light Clay. And um, Margarina is the only Pokemon that has been banned so far, but uh, these Pokemon and maybe others will be looked at later too. Uh, you know, they're gonna see how the meta now evolves with Magirna being banned. So yeah, Magirna 9-0 ban. Everybody voted ban for this. So if you didn't know, to ban a Pokemon, 7 out of the 9 members have to vote ban. Uh, under that, that means the Pokemon will stay OU, which is the case for the rest of this Pokemon. So let's go over them real quick. Chinpao, 6-3, almost ban, but not, uh, you know, not yet. Light Clay, 217. I mean, Light Clay, I don't think Light Clay deserves to be banned right now. Uh, especially when some of these Pokemon will get banned later, because I'm pretty sure these Pokemon are going to get banned later. Light Clay is not going to be the problem that it is right now. Especially Magirna was also one of the best Pokemon behind dual screens, and it's now gone. So yeah, Sneasler, 5 4. Yeah. I can see why I don't think sneeze. I mean, Dire Claw is broken. Don't get me wrong, but for right now, I I say yeah, let it stay in the tier. Rushifu Rapid Strike got one eight, which is uh, you know majority did not think it is a problem. You know it is a problem, but I wouldn't say it's ban worthy right now. Ursuluna got three six. Surprised about that. I thought more people would vote to ban Ursuluna. Volcarona zero nine. Yeah, I don't think Volcarona deserves to be banned in the slightest and both summer center forms summer center crown got 6-3 so it was almost banned and summer center hero got 4-5 so yeah let's go for magirna uh, let's you know look at their reasoning real quick so yeah magirna is one of the most dynamic and versatile offensive pokemon capable of breaking through the bulkiest of teams with one set as it stacks boosts boosts while capitalizing on fragile offenses with the next as it deploys seemingly perfect coverage Terrestrialization bolsters its offense profile while simultaneously granting free turns defensively for it to continue to position itself well. But other methods of team support such as dual screens or even trick room can run up the score promptly on foes as well. And um, you know, of course, also got spikes. Choice packs also very powerful set. Assault Vest is still good. And uh, you know, it was used as a trick room setter as well with Fleur Cannon and Eject Pack, which allows it to Fire off a super powerful Fleur Cannon and then switch out for free to one of its Trick Room abusers. One of those being Ursaluna, <laughs> which is very common on a team like that. And yeah, there were variants to this set, but yeah, uh, this set, as you can see on the screen right now, this was the set that pushes over the edge. Pretty much the same set that was used in Gen 8 and also got banned for, because of this. But even then, this Pokemon still has other things going for it, super versatile, so even. If it's not running the set, it can just... You know, let's say you switch a Pokemon in to counter this set. You also always have to be wary of this. So you have to go to the Pokemon that can counter this or else it's going to get out of hand. And then it just hits you with a Choice Max Lure Cannon, for example. Yeah. That you always need one, maybe two counters for the Pokemon. It can beat Pokemon that it should not be able to beat, which is kind of crazy. But yeah, Shift Gear, Calm Mind. Uh, you know, a Double Dance set. Gives it insane boosts to stored power, which it can then use with massive base power. Not to mention that Calm Mind is also boosting special attack stat, so it's get even stronger. Soul Heart, which boosts its special attack stat after it gets a KO, so it can even snowball from there. And you get Stab Draining Kiss, which gives it 75% of the damage it uh, dealt as recovery. You know, 50 base power is not that strong. But the healing you get from it, not to mention the stab boost, and you get Calm Mind boosting special attack, it's a lot. You know, pair that with leftovers for more longevity, or even weakness policy, which gives you even more boosts, so you can set, make setting up easier. And yeah, this Pokemon is, is just too much. Amazing defensive typing, one of the best in the game, if not the best. Then you got even go Terra Water to set up a Pokemon that could hit you for super effective damage. It's just too much. 
But yeah, Magirna. With Magirna now being gone, it was one of the better Chin Pao checks. So with that being gone, we only have a couple Pokemon that can check Chin Pao. Two of those being the Zamazenta forms. And our Ishifu is can also switch in once, but it's not really a check or counter in the slightest because after switching it once that Pokemon is cannot co come in again. So yeah, Magirna Band. Um, I think Screens or Trick Room now gets a heavy nerf because Magirna was one of the better Trick Room setters and Ursaluna really appreciated its uh, support role as a Trick Room setter. So I'm curious to see how that's gonna impact Ursaluna's performance and I'm also gonna be curious to see if now Chin Pao is gonna be running rampant even more. But yeah, Zamazenta, Crown, and Hero are pretty common, so that might keep it in check. But I'm pretty sure that if Zamazenta goes before Chin Pao, then Chin Pao will just be banned afterwards. Oh yeah, what I also want to mention is for the short time that it was available in May, so that's only for May, so it was like available for two days, it managed to be the 21 most used Pokemon in the tier in just two days, which says a lot about how... Uh, you know how good this Pokemon actually is. Uh, for now, I don't really have much to say about this. Uh, it's only one ban. I expected at least two. Uh, but yeah, only one ban for now. We're gonna see how it evolves. Uh, potentially bans that might happen later. And yeah, with that being said, thank you for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, and see you next time.